What's up, good people? Welcome to Miles from India. I am back with a new bra review, and today I'm going to be reviewing the Fly Out Zip Bra by Wazel. So check it out. people welcome to miles from india if you are new to my channel i am india and if you're returning what's up and welcome back so i am back with another bra review and i am so excited to be doing this bra review it is the wazelle fly out zip bra and as you can see it looks great and comfortable so today i am going to talk about the pros and cons of this bra and i will also discuss size inclusivity support which also includes its adjustability its comfortability which also includes chafing because y'all know chafing is a big thing for me pricing and i'm just going to give you all an overall rating of this bra but before we get into all of that let's talk about some of the specs or the detail of the bra okay so the material of this bra is a play interlock which is basically a mix of a polyester and a spandex now of course you all know that usually that's the makeup of a bra which is good and just really quick tip for you ladies don't dryer your or dry your bras in the in a dryer it kind of takes out the elasticity so i typically hang dry my bras so straight out of the washing machine hang them up let them air dry so that's just a quick little tip for you guys <laughs> the inside of the material is a power mesh lining as you can see it also has a front zip and clip removable club cups which i still have my cups in this bra and i ran with the cups in this bra so i did not remove them um and it also has a mesh pocket area whoop, a mesh pocket area for your phone so let's talk about sizing so this bra comes in from a size 2 to a 14. so i am a traditional um, bra size of a 36 or 38 double d and i am wearing the size 12 and this is also the size 12. and this bra comes in three different colors this is a new launch so the bra comes in the color the two colors that i have here and then also comes in like a mint green it's almost like a sage color that is really pretty but hopefully as they um continue to grow the line there will be more colors in the zip front all right guys so you all know let's talk about support so on Wazelle's website, they have this as a support of a two. So it means that it's not a huge, a high level of support. I have worn this bra twice on four mile runs. I felt like I did have support. However, it is not high support. So there definitely is bounce, not a whole lot, but there definitely is bounce with this bra. I find myself, I probably would not wear this bra over a four mile run just because I want a little bit more support. Now, this bra does not have any adjustability. So there is nothing in here. There's no tightening of the band. There's no tightening of the straps. And so when you put this bra on, you have to ensure that you have the right size to ensure that there is some support. Now, I did think about down going down the size to receive a little bit more support. But for my ladies like myself that are well endowed, I think if you were to size down, I might have a concern with side boob or, or the top. But it could be an option if you wanted a little bit more support. All right, so let's get into the comfortability of this bra. So this bra actually is very comfortable. There's nothing sticking me, there's nothing pinching, nothing of that nature. And again, I wore this bra twice on a four mile run. Now, what I was concerned about was the, the clips that you have to put on here. Sometimes those can dig into your skin. I did not have any concerns with the, the clips digging in. I had no chafing, and you all know that I'm a girl that sweats, so no chafing at all. So I will say comfortability, it's pretty good. Now, a big thing when it comes to this bra as far as comfort, being able to take this thing on and off was really easy. Now, ladies, I don't know about y'all, but when I take my bra off when I have like eraser bike bras or other bras it is resistance band training to get this thing off because you're sweaty and the bra just doesn't come off easy with this one I was able to unzip it unlatch it and take it right off so I definitely love the ease of getting the bra on and off now the bra does have a pocket for your phone 
So I don't know about you all, but I have used koala clips, which is something that you can clip onto the side of your pocket or the back of your bra. I did not like it. So when I saw that this one had a pouch, I said, you know what? Let's see if this is more comfortable for me. And honestly, it was. The only thing about it is when I took my phone out, it was sweaty because your girl is a sweater. It was definitely sweaty. So if you're a sweater, you want to be cognizant of that. But the comfortability of the material that um, holds the bra and where it sits in between my shoulders was perfect all right now as you all can see the bra is definitely a longer bra so it comes down a little further than your traditional bra so with that I feel like I have on um Wiesel shorts as well if I was to wear some high-waisted shorts along with this bra I would feel comfortable wearing this bra out and about or not out and about like going anywhere but without a top and not feeling concerned about kind of how I feel because I feel like it has more of a shirt look and feel to it versus having limited uh limited material so the, it has a lot more material to cover the girls and the way that it covers the back as well so that is something that I definitely love all right guys so lastly let's talk about pricing so the price of this bra is $68 now for me I feel like it's right within the market of the majority of your bras that are out right now that's going to give you a good quality bra so I don't think it is too steep however I would love for some of the brands to come down off the prices a little bit but still give us some quality because having a hundred dollars almost a hundred dollar bra is a bit much but hey that's just my opinion all right, so I am going to now do a rapid fire pro and con list for you guys. Let's start out with the cons and we'll close it out with the pros. So the five cons that I have for this obviously is the support. I am a well-endowed individual and I need as much support as I can. That does not mean that I can't wear this bra because I can, but it will definitely be for low impact days. And because it's so comfortable, I wish I had a little bit more support so that I can wear it on a long run. Number two, no adjustability. I really love adjustability bras, but however, this one is a really good bra, but unfortunately there's no other way to adjust if you have areas that you want to tighten up. Number three, I would definitely say it was a little bit of a bummer that my phone was sweaty when I got done um, with the run because the phone was in the back. But again, I could put my phone in like a Ziploc bag or something of that nature and slide it in, which may be something that I can do on shorter runs. But definitely the material, if you're a sweater, it's not going to be the best for you if you want to ensure that your phone is protected. Number four, I will say size inclusivity. Um, I, th I think that I, I am very appreciative that Wazelle has a size for me being that again I am a 36 to 38 double D so I can wear a size 12 in this bra however I feel like the sizing of this bra could exceed to 16 18 22 more in the plus size range so that would be definitely a good thing so the last con is the clip and eye area I am a little concerned with excessive use of this because it is not metal it is cloth I'm concerned with excessive use that I hope that that, that clip holds up because your girl doesn't want to unzip during a run all right now let's get into the pros so of course I love how easy it was to take this bra off it literally was a zip unclip and take it off there was no stress on getting this thing off number two no chafing I didn't have any issues with chafing or underneath the band for the, the clip area or underneath the band and I just realized that I didn't have this thing pulled all the way over cover that so the zipper does not come down good good thing I was not running <laughs> number three this is really good quality material like I can tell that oh, after some washes it's still going to be a good bra I like the material on the outside as well as the mesh filling in the inside number four I feel like this is really good coverage again I talked about being able to wear this out so the fact that this has a little bit higher neckline as well as this area is here I think that it has a really good coverage and I don't feel like I'm going to be falling over or falling out and number five I definitely think it is a it the price is in a marketable range for a lot of the other bras that are currently out there so overall I will give this bra a four out of five 
definitely i think the biggest thing the biggest takeaway or the con that kind of takes me a little bit out of wearing this bra a lot a lot is right now i am training for a half marathon and i am doing a lot of distance runs so i'm not sure that this run will be this bra will be able to hold me the way that i would need to on my long distance runs but on the days that i'm doing my strength training cross training and my easy conversation three to four mile runs I will definitely grab this one. So thank you all so much for watching this video. Thank you for Wazelle for allowing me to try out this try out this bra. Of course, my review has nothing to do with Wazelle and how they provided me this bra. Your girl keeps it real. But I want to say thank you all for that. And lastly, I want to say thank you all for watching. And definitely give your girl a like, subscribe to this channel. I have other reviews as well as other run-related content on my channel. So show your girl some love. We'll see you again soon.